everyone. My name is Amanda Parks and I work for Texas A&M AgriLife Extension. We help bring education and research to the public to help better your life. Thank you for joining us on our adventure from Path to the Plate, Poultry Edition. Over the next 22 days, we'll be having fun as we discover how eggs turn into chicks. Now, we're going to be diving in from the very beginning today on the farm. Today, we're going to figure out where our chickens live, what they eat, and how our farmers keep them healthy and happy. So let's take a look. On the farm, in order to have eggs that hatch into chicks, we must first have a mama hen that lays the eggs. Here in our office, we use a farmer that raises her chicks and her, her chickens outside. The hens live outside so they have plenty of fresh air every day, and she also gives them fresh water and feed every time she goes outside. Most chickens have to live the nighttime in a coop. This is one way that a, that a coop might look, but there's lots of other plans out there that might look different. The reason that chickens have to live in the coop is because at night there are predators. The predators can hurt and sometimes kill the chickens. So the farmer puts them in the coop to keep them safe. Predators might be anything from a fox to a dog to maybe even a snake. Now, what do our chickens eat? This is an, is an example of the feed that our farmer uses to feed her chickens. This is a pelleted feed, which means it has lots of different things put into a tiny little pellet that the chickens can eat super easily. Inside our pellet might include corn, wheat, milo, and maybe even some calcium, some limestone to help have healthy eggs. Chickens also enjoy treats such as um, fruits and veggies, and sometimes our farmer gives them mealworms. They really like those. Now, did you know that there are hundreds of breeds of chickens? Chickens can have tons of different looks. Some are green and brown and some are white. There's over 500 varieties of chickens. Humans have been breeding different types of chickens for different needs. These chickens down here are white and normally the white birds tend to be our meat birds. They're gonna grow really fast and really efficient and then they end up in the store on our meat counter. Whereas the chickens that look like this normally are our egg laying producing chickens. They were created to lay eggs efficiently and some of them lay over 300 eggs a year. That's a lot of eggs. That's pretty cool. Did you know that chickens originated from uh, wild fowl that were in the jungles of Asia hundreds of years ago? Then humans domesticated them to help feed us. Now. So all of our chickens are happy and healthy. The farmer's been taking care of them. They live in the coop. They eat lots of feed and they have great fresh water every day. So they start laying eggs and every day the farmer goes out and collects those eggs. This big guy with the comb on the top of his head is called a rooster. When there's a mama hen and a rooster, normally that allows the eggs to be fertilized. Eggs can only become chicks if they've been fertilized. The eggs that you find in your store are not fertilized. They only have hens that out at that place where they lay eggs. There's no daddy roosters. So you're not eating baby chicks when you eat your exit from the store. But our eggs come from a lady that has both hens and roosters. So our eggs will turn into chicks at the end of our 21 day cycle. Now, that concludes day one. Tomorrow, we're gonna be talking about what our eggs look like what's inside the eggs, and when we put them into an incubator, how all of that works. So tune in tomorrow to learn more.